tell you, this was my second earthquake in Dubai. Uh, first one was a couple of years ago. We were in JLT when it happened. This one, this time, we're in uh, on Sheikh Zayed Road, opposite the Trade Center. And I got to tell you, I felt the tremor under my feet. I was sitting on the chair, and I could just see the building sway. It wasn't a pretty sight, but we're getting the aftershocks from what's being tweeted as a 7.5. Uh, and this is sort of the aftershock, but again, it's nothing to be taken lightly. It's a serious matter, and we've got to take all the precautions that's uh, required. And the guys who are doing the um, so organizing are doing a pretty good job in rounding up the people, giving them direction to go, and uh, making sure they stay out of harm's way. So if um, you are in an earthquake zone right now, our thoughts and prayers are with you. Stay out of harm's way, stay away from tall buildings, and uh, be safe. So basically a couple of days ago, two or three days ago, there was a small earthquake in Iran uh, that set everyone on a worry because there's a nuclear power plant in Iran uh, in an area called uh, Bashir, I think. Uh, and this nuclear power plant is actually closer to Dubai and Abu Dhabi than it is to the capital of Iran, which is Tehran. So everyone in the UAE is very worried. Uh, the GCC countries actually have put into a request into the UN to have a uh, nuclear team go into the, the, to the site and assess the, uh, the sturdiness, the worthiness of this nuclear power plant. Now, right now, there's just been an earthquake that has hit 7.5 on the Richter scale, which is incredibly high. I, in fact, actually felt it. Uh, we've just evacuated out of the building. With a lot of people, it's actually quite exciting. So the big question now is, how is this going to affect the nuclear power plant? It's on everyone's lips. Everyone's worried about it. I'm worried about it because if this thing melts down, there's a malfunction. If the wind blows the nuclear fallout this way, the whole of the Middle East, the whole of the UAE, the whole of the Gulf is going to get it, uh, which is not good. So uh, hopefully everything will be sorted out. Hopefully the nuclear power plant is fine. Uh, and we're all good.